Girl, what's going on with Tamar and David? <laughs> All right, so you guys know David was her boo, right? Her fiance or something. I don't know what's going on with them, but they something, right? Girl, honey, you see, you see we on her page, right? Look, look at her page. She don't got none on her page. Now, you know she loves to have a whole bunch of stuff on her page. Girl, they say she don't delete it everything and she came with the message about relationships girl girl it's gonna make you wonder but before i get to this message i'm gonna need you guys to do me a big favor make sure you guys like this video share this video subscribe to the youtube channel gossip girl xoxo you know you love me all right so check this out okay check this out all right tamar braxton Woo. If they don't want you, there's no talking, no reasoning. Let it go and let God bring you the one who will be all that you need to accept all of you. Your flaws will not be your weakness, but it will be your strength and attraction to the one that is meant to be in your life. Girl, that don't sound like a happy couple to me. All right. And you know how she had her videos on her Instagram full of pictures with her and David. Oh, my God. You couldn't get enough of them. Now she deletes all of that stuff. I'm scared to go on uh, David Instagram because, you know, he do all these goddamn paragraphs. And these paragraphs, I can't I can't take David when he was reading. Now, I know y'all going to start with y'all speculations, girl. I'm going to watch him in the comment section. I ain't saying nothing. I ain't saying nothing about David. I ain't saying that. I'm just going to let y'all do all this. But clearly, if they don't want you, there's no talking, no reasoning. Who don't want you, Tamar? Okay? And if he ain't want you, girl, why was he entertaining you? What did he want from you? You know, did he want that money you got? Did he want you to be a fool and invest in his business? Girl, what's going on? And then let it go and let God bring you the one. So this so this man ain't sent from God then. <laughs> Because if this man sent from God, then I don't think she'd be saying that unless God just delivering men up to you. Uh, let it go and let God bring you the one who will be all that you need to accept all of you. So he didn't accept all of you. What part didn't he accept, girl? You know what I mean? And why is it you got to bring God into all your mess? I mean, she did this with Vince. <laughs> she put God up in that. And now she putting God up in this, you know? I just don't know, girl. I don't know. I don't know. At first, God sent this to me. You know, God worked it out. This was sent from God. He's heaven sent. Now, this ain't this from the devil, and I'm waiting on God to send me my true love. Girl, what the fuck? <laughs> Listen, go ahead with y'all bad stuff, all right? Uh, your flaws will not be your weakness, but it will be your strength. An attraction to the one that is meant to be in your life. All right? Whew. Girl, I don't know what to think about this. We can't read one person. Somebody says, Tamar needs therapy real bad. Until she faces her issues, seeks deliverance. Oh, hell no. Nah. <laughs> seeks deliverance? What, girl? She just got finished talking about God about to send her a man. You talk about she needs to be delivered. Which one is? Okay. Then healing. She's going to forgive. She's going to forever go in circles. Sister seriously needs help. She's a broken, w w wounded bird. Self-reflection should be her priority. And ain't let's talk about them friends she got, you know? Because you need to throw them friends away. Huh. All them people that she be having with around Tamar. Girl, I don't know. Your family ain't helping you with this? I don't know what's going on. I know she cool with Nene and Wendy. They ain't saying nothing. Hmm. I don't know. Comment, let us know what you guys think about this. And I'll see you guys sooner than later. Bye.